Do you have the jelly effect in your video and have balanced everything and it's still there? Well, maybe it's the motors. Over the winter, I was going to build a couple of small hexacopters. To power them, I ordered a dozen Turnigy motors from Hobby King. When they arrived, I installed one on my thrust test stand to check out the performance. I was shocked by the vibration it produced. I set up a dial gauge on my lathe to check out the motor. As I suspected, it had a bent shaft. I then checked the remaining motors. Here is what a good motor reads on the dial gauge. Zero. Out of the 12 motors I bought, four had bent shafts. That's a 25% failure rate and a sure sign of poor manufacturing and quality control. If Hobby King did send me new motors, chances are one of them would have a bent shaft. I'll be ahead by just making new shafts for these motors. As an aside, if you don't have a dial gauge to check your motors, you can check them by removing the props and spinning up the motor and then feeling the end of the shaft. If you feel a tingle in your fingertips, the shaft is bent. If you feel only a drag on your fingertips, the shaft is straight. Hope you found this video useful. If you did, give a thumbs up and please subscribe.